Hello, we're the Walkers. I'm Ashifa, and this is my husband, Mike. Um, approximately about a year and a half ago, um, we set out to start the endeavor of um, purchasing our own home. You want to go ahead and tell our wonderful testimony? Right. So uh, we started, honestly, and this is like right when COVID hit. Everything was great. Like, you know, uh, we sent our information in. We got our pre-approval letter. Uh, they were going off of my business and, you know, things were fine. And then I want to say maybe less than a week, uh, we get a denial because COVID restrictions kind of sat in and quit. You know, we continue to go uh, go forward. We end up getting another, uh, another lender. Everything was fine. We got the pre-approval. We start the process of building our home. Um, I want to say three, four months go by, everything is fine. I want to say maybe three weeks before our closing date, we get a call. If anybody knows, if you're in business, there, there was got to, there's some deviation from how well you did in 2019 to how well you did in 2020, most businesses anyway. So there was obviously a drop off for me. And at that point, we're back to square one. My faith uh, wavered a little bit. I'm not gonna say I lost faith, but my faith was wavering because I was doing all the works. I know I'm, I'm tired, I'm fasting, uh, you know, I'm, we both, I'm are. both of us. <laughs> our we family's on board, you know, our parents. We kept getting denied. Uh, and so at that point, I was honestly, I, you know, I was ready to give up. It's not the time. But at that, that moment, I think too, where we um, we were at my at my parents' house, I think and we were standing in the room and we were talking to my parents and my dad was high asleep and he wakes up and he says, did y'all consider trying the credit union again? <laughs> I had already submitted this information to the credit union. They told us, you know, everything was good. The lenders that we originally had seeked out told us that we were going to need about 25% down. If it means us putting X amount of dollars to get into our home, let's just go ahead and do the credit union. Got our final approval. They turned out and asked us, how much money y'all want to put down? That completely blew our minds. My husband was like, wait a minute. This can't be happening. It's too easy at this point. But with God, we know that all things work together for the good of them that love the Lord and are called to his purpose. And with us being faithful in our tithing, faithful in our sowing, faithful in blessing other people, God had to shine down that light on us and show grace, favor, and mercy. And we're just happy. One thing I do want to say is this. Uh -huh. Even though we were doing all the works, we had all the faith and for me, there was a void in relationship. I honestly didn't, I wasn't really in my Bible like I should be. Um, I wasn't listening, uh, you know, on the audio book, uh, listening to the Bible. I wasn't having conversations with, with God. Um, I wasn't being specific and intentional with things that I wanted uh, and the things that I, I knew that, you know, in his word that he said that he would give us as far as our desires. And that's when he came in. Yeah. The faith was there. The works were there, but the relationship wasn't. Yeah. And at that point, when the relationship started, that's when he took over. Yeah. And it just was like, this this is too easy. But he got in there. You know, he was in there. He stood before us at that point. And, you know, you've done enough, my child. It's, it's my turn. Me, yeah. And at that point, um, you know, it was, it was easy selling. And uh, we closed, and this house, um is, is is god's house so that's our story uh they say we well, know there's no testimony without a test uh we definitely had a test and uh we were able to persevere